everyone. So we have something exciting to do today because for some reason there are now over 300 people subscribed to this channel. <laughs> Woo! It's very amazing. I love all of you equally. I wanted to do something to celebrate the fact that we've got over 300 subscribers on this teensy tiny little channel which when I started just had a video of my dog playing fetch on it. So I wanted to do something that I haven't done on the channel before and we thought about the different kind of YouTube videos that are out there and I decided I'm gonna make a reaction video. What better to react to than something that is a bit of a craze? K-pop! But I'm not gonna do the whole genre because that would be a long video. There's and a lot, there's a lot happening. Out our there. dinner's in the oven, so um, we've gotta keep this brief. So <laughs> we've decided Priorities. To, yeah. We've decided to go with a K-pop band that I am familiar with. I like a lot of songs by, even though I do mishear the lyrics a lot. But I don't know everything about them, and luckily I have a fan of the band, not of me. Also with, of you. With me in the form of Leslie. Leslie, who are we reacting to today? Today we're going to react to BTS. <gasps> Let's all grab a hot turtle shako and watch some BTS. <laughs> this is a latte, will that do? Yeah. To so, YouTube! So you have heard some BTS songs. I there have. are some BTS songs on our shared playlist. Yes. Yep. I thought we could watch three things. Because okay. you, you specifically requested some dancing. Yes. So I thought we should watch their first ever music video. Have you seen that? What's the song? Uh, it's called No More Dream. I don't think so. So we'll watch their first ever music video and feel old. Mm -hmm. We're going to watch a dance practice because your favourite BTS song is... War of Hormone. But there's been some criticism of that song. Why? In that its lyrics can be considered to be a bit misogynistic. So I thought we would listen to uh, BTS's most feminist song. Nice. Which happens to have a dance practice. Excellent. And uh, then we're going to watch a video with some very impressive dancing in. But they're not dancing to their own songs. It's time! Leslie. It's time to like type in. Use, in. use the computer. Please don't judge me on my recommended or recently watched videos. <laughs> I feel like that's like just a pact between friends. Mm, like yeah. if one of us dies, yeah. oh, the God. other one yeah. just wipes yeah. the other's computer. Here you go. Do you want to like look at the lyrics or anything first? Oh yes. Oh yeah. We're we're not at Emma's house or my house. We're at our friend Sarah's house because she's away, and we are being fairy dog mothers for the weekend. Yes. And Bobby just occasionally likes to also react to Life. anything that's going on around him. Are you okay, Bobster? <laughs> Okay, Mum, I'm going to the library. I am here for that. Anything about libraries is fine by me. Who do you see in your mirror? I gotta say, go your own way. These are, I'm, fe I'm getting very bizarre Michael Jackson Fleetwood Mac crossover vibes. That's exciting. Yeah, it sounds exactly like that. Mm -hmm. Oh, I was really, I'm sad now because I really hoped that Don't Hesitate, Don't Hesitate, What's Up was the end of the song. Cause that um, is- What was that? That. That, yeah. This is how I rap. This is what's up. When I'm in the rap line for EL. <laughs> is that our K-pop band? our K-pop band. We're not Korean. And no. we can't speak Korean. No. Um, I think there could be a problem. Okay. So it's about, don't just think about, oh, I've got to pass the exam and get this job because that's what my parents say I have to do Ooh. to decide what they want to do for themselves, but then to work hard to pursue it and don't just ex expect like success to fall in their lap. Can I just say, well, well done. Well, well played, I mean, that's BTS. right, really. It is, not only is it right, but it's, it's a pop song that isn't like, Oh, and she was wearing a nice outfit. She was so hot. But that's my favourite song. Like, is that a school bus? Yeah. Immediately. Immediate reaction. 
My school bus was nothing like this. Have they stolen this bus? Oh, have they? I don't know. I mean, why Why are they on the bus with no one else if they haven't stolen the bus? What is... What is... Mm, I don't know. I'm liking the black and white aesthetic. That's the bit about the library. Ah. Does it sound like you expected it to sound? No, I was expecting for their debut when they were quite young it would be less... No. Can I just say, just from watching this, I will never get my eyeliner as perfect as any of these people. There is some excellent guy liner. There's some very low trouser happening. <laughs> I'm not a fan. No. There's some, the, I mean, there's some very coordinated dancing happening. Boy bands Wait. don't dance now. No, they don't. What have they done to this school? Is this like, have they burnt it down? It's, it's slightly post apocalyptic. Isn't it, it is. That was cool. I liked the baseball. To be honest, I feel like I might have enjoyed school a bit more if we if could. There were small buses and graffiti. We could just well, no, not buses. I hated the school bus, but if we could just graffiti the school. Hmm. For, like, Put in a skate ramp. Yeah, do some BMXing. And if I'd had good eyeliner. How old are they in this? Um, so Jungkook is probably about 15 or 16 and he's the youngest and Jin the eldest is probably about 21. <laughs> I'm trying to read what it says on the chalkboard and I'm failing. Is it is it meant to be like a mathematical equation? <laughs> oh, I didn't we could we can like freeze frame it and analyze later. It's probably got oh, like it's probably got like eight albums in advance of yeah. what they're gonna do. I mean, I'm now starting to think I wouldn't have enjoyed being in this school because it seems to be quite violent. At the risk of sounding slightly mean, some of the like the kind of violence is a little bit like. Ugh. It's like mm, I don't, I don't think they're violent people on the inside. I think they've they've tried a bit hard. I'm I'm gonna throw it out there mm. and say oh! <laughs> that was not my comment. <laughs> Ugh, what's your opinion on BTS? What do you think? Do you like them? Are you a fan? Yeah. Oh, I like, I like Jimin. Well done. Do you? Could you point out which one was Jimin? No, because I'm just making this up with my dog. There we go. Good. How about we go back down onto the floor where you belong? Bye bye, little oh, bear. But my fans need to see me. She's so cute. I will go to my grave bemused by the hat tea towel thing. <laughs> um, I mean, often. he's my favourite, yeah. but his outfits are the weirdest. Uh -huh. So do you want to look at the lyrics for the next song okay. again? And then we can play a game of what does it actually sound like? So 21st century girls. I love a song that has the word elegant in it. You look elegant, elegant. Also, you're pretty pretty. I mean, <laughs> I... <laughs> I just am imagining who is it the same. This is RM. I you we were watching Burn the Stage last we night and you got Burn quite invested stage. and you kept sort of being quite impressed by RM. RM, I'm so I'm just so again, <laughs> I'm so proud of him. He's so he's such, such a, a nice boy. He's such a nice boy. <laughs> um, we don't mean to be patronizing. No, I'm not. He's a grown man. He is but a grown man. I'm just old. old. Um, no, I think I, I was watching Burn the Stage last night. We haven't finished it, no. so you know, very exciting later tonight. Um, but he he is a really good leader, I think, and I love that. Is that a thing in all K-pop bands? They have like a yes, leader. they have a, a leader. I love that. 
Ah. I mean, can you imagine like the size of some of those groups if there wasn't one person in charge? The chaos. Yeah. I mean, you know what it's like at chorus and. Oh God. Yeah. I'm imagining him being really suavely dressed and being like, "You look elegant, elegant. Also, you're pretty, pretty." Ooh. That was uh, that's the that's a big hit. <laughs> Just messaging me to be like, you've stop. Got, you've got problems. <laughs> Leave them alone. <laughs> Who's been insulting this woman? Okay, because I'm just. If anyone keeps insulting you, insulting you, tell them you're my lady. Go tell them, tell them. I mean, who has been insulting this person? Why? Leave her alone. And she shouldn't. I'm gonna just throw this out there. She shouldn't have to go. Oh, this is my boyfriend, so don't have a go at me. Yeah, that's. Yeah, a little bit problematic yeah. as a lyric. I'm really concerned about this girl's life. <laughs> because, because with Jungkook going, don't ever be scared what people say, you're okay, all right? Like, who's bullying this woman? It's like the entire world on her. Like, you are so rubbish and so ugly, but it's okay because BTS like you. You've absolutely taken this in a direction I did not expect you to. I mean, I like tell them that you're strong, tell them you're enough. I'm very ple- blessed. Blessed, we're blessed I'm by the song. So blessed. <laughs> wow. Has my caffeine like gone <laughs> into you I somehow? Think, I think so. I love anything that is like a classic, oh my ladies, put your hands up. Thing. That just always just pleases me, and anything where they go now scream, <laughs> because that's sinister. <laughs> that's sinister. Now scream. Oh no, is that meant to have a B in it? Where? Oh, Bay. No, it's Bay. They love saying Bay. You don't like Bay. She doesn't I... like Bay. Bay is Danish for poop. Correct me if I'm wrong. Iris, you will know this. If is is or is not Bay, some kind of Danish for poo. How would you feel if I called you Bay? I don't mind it. Oh, okay. All right, Bay. There we go. Well, that's that's an interesting development you've just <laughs> witnessed. Doesn't bother me. Sorry. Oh, hang on a minute. To the twentieth century girls. Holla. That's us. That's, Hello. That's us. Uh, live your life. How much does it bother you that people born in the year two thousand are now adults? Oh no. <laughs> Why am I on YouTube? I'm a fossil. Like, no. I'm close to death. <laughs> no. Live your life. Come on, baby. Thank you. Aww. <laughs> Even though she's quoting, I'm gonna take that. So everybody wanna love you. Everybody gonna love you. I do like the whole vibe of you deserve to be loved. And that you're fine as you are. Mm. That's a nice mm. message. I'm here for that message. I like that. I think that's good. A, that's that's good. In my mind, that's a sort of mid-tempo poppy number. Okay. You did a face. I am wrong. <laughs> so I'm gonna warn you that they do dance practice videos. Um, that's actually how I got into K-pop. Is it? Yeah. Well. <sighs> Story time, you're, you're gonna have such fun <laughs> editing all of this nonsense together. So we both are part of the same barbershop chorus. And she's director of I'm it. director. Before I was director, I was the choreographer. Don't think that means I can dance. But because I used to have to do warm-ups and stuff, I would often go on YouTube and look for dance routines mm -hmm. and K-pop dance practice videos started to kind of infect my yeah. YouTube recommendations, and that is how I just tumbled down. Oh, the K hole. The... <laughs> Let's not say that. Let's never call it that. Let's never call Let's it that. Let's never use that phrase again. So, yeah, they do dance practices. And this one is at Halloween. Oh. So, they have some outfits on. Immediately, I'm traumatized. I'm. Is it because the cabbage has a face? Is it a cabbage? I think it's some kind of... Well, it's a vegetable. I'm gonna have nightmares about my vegetables that I have eaten for dinner just dancing. I feel like these are not outfits conducive There's some to difficult dancing. shoes. There are some really... yeah. I mean, I can't dance without being dressed as a cabbage or a bunny, or having a horse attached to me. So, this is impressive. What 
what do you think of the song? Excellent. Good. I mean, it goes slightly chaotic at this point. Yeah. Oh, oh no! He's man down. down! Man down! And now they're having a fight. That's a dance move I could do. Yeah, I think I could do that one. I mean, I could do that. Hmm. Oh, oh. oh no, no, showboating went wrong. <laughs> now do you feel threatened? <laughs> I feel like I'm watching Donnie Darko on <laughs> acid. Credit to the ones who have worn outfits that make this incredibly difficult. I imagine like the bunny suit is warm. Yeah. I mean, I can't, you know, do a little shinny without breaking a sweat because I'm very unfit. But oh, the cabbage hat's gone. Oh no. If I was doing an entire dance routine whilst dressed as a vegetable. Which vegetable would you pick? Naturally, I would be a monge too. Naturally. Naturally. Do you know what? Credit to them for not taking themselves too seriously. Yeah. I'm just... Uh, there's... Yeah. I've never... She can't sentence. I can't <laughs> sentence. I like the song. Yeah, good. It's a good song. Uh, and I still stand by the sentiment of the song. I'm just... I just, I, more bands need to do this. Just more costumes. More costumes, more of the time, please. How would you feel mm. if your favourite band, mm. Manic Street Preachers, just came on stage all in, you know, <gasps> weird outfits? Well, to be... Okay. Oh, it's story time again, because she's man, done this. I've done... This is how you know. <laughs> the Manics are famed for wearing weird outfits. They're just not that... Kind a different of flavor of different weird. kind of weird. Their bassist, who is a six foot four man, quite often wears dresses um, and weird. tiaras and feather boas and leopard print jackets and stuff. That's just that's what he does. Sometimes he wears a skirt made out of a Welsh flag. I think if they came on stage all dressed as vegetables, <laughs> I would be. I wonder what could happen. <laughs> I suppose they'd all be leaks. They'd have to. That be leaks. could have been a leak. Oh, maybe it was a leak! I mean, it's quite... I don't know if the legs are part of it. BTS fans. We've really, like... Please tell me what vegetable this is. We've really kind of narrowed in on this vegetable thing. I've zoomed in on the vegetable because it just looks so hard to dance in and I'm so confused. Why would you do that to yourself? Are you ready for the final one? Yes. This, I think, is something... Um, if I get this wrong, I'm so sorry for all the comments explaining uh, why I'm wrong. I think this was from a TV show or something. Okay. But they didn't film it very well. Oh. So the record company, Big Hit, did it again. Oh. So there's the same performance and you'll see a, a, like a title card that says good camera, very good camera. And it's basically them saying, excuse me, this is how you should have done it. Oh. Oh, shade. Shade. From the thumbnail, mm. I'm really expecting them to be covering Take My Breath Away because the military <laughs> they all vibe. It's all very an officer and a gentleman. Film references. Yes. Um, that has got nothing to do with it. Excellent. There is some military inspiration somewhere in the dance routine. You're going to recognise one of these songs as well, mm -hmm. and I think you're going to enjoy it. Very good camera. <laughs> Oh. Army of BTS. Oh. I mean, it's naval, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Screw hats. Yeah, nobody needs a hat. Do you know what? If that was me and I tried to wear the hat, I'd just like hit punch the person, person in front of me and the hat would go nowhere. I like that they are the officers. They, mm. you know, they're not just sailors. And they've got a lot of medals. Yes, here's my outfit. What is with the whole like wrap thing of holding your trousers up? Um, 
I'm not I it. assume it's it's like because they don't want to pinch anything when they're dancing. <laughs> That isn't actually rerun, they're just doing everything backwards. They have to do everything backwards? Yeah. That's very clever. Ooh, impressive. Of Linkin Park, why not? Not Linkin Park. Um, Lip Biscuit. Lip Biscuit. I knew it began with that. I knew you'd recognise this. I feel like I, if I attempted this dance routine, I'd look like I was having an aneurysm of some kind. <laughs> When I think of um, a, a stereotypical sailor, I'm thinking of bell bottoms, so that's not her. They would be really hard to dance in. Yeah, you would be. get tangled up in your own trouser leg. Yeah. I'm thinking of like someone in one leg of the bell bottoms and someone in the other leg of the bell bottoms because I don't know what's wrong with my brain. That's a video we need to make. <laughs> we need to share a large pair of trousers and try and learn a dance routine. If you want to see that, subscribe to this channel. Please, don't. Please do. I really want to do that now. That would be hilarious. Look at how excited she is. Well, thank you. Is that was that is that our journey done? For now, yeah. Well, Unless I mean now. we can sit here and watch it all night and burn our dinner. We probably shouldn't. No. Final thoughts on BTS. Excellent hair. Also excellent songs yeah I, I do genuinely think they are very good songs mm. and i will also just go out there and and end this video by again just praising her she doesn't get enough praise <laughs> i didn't do any of this I, I just typed the I'm names just, no, no 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 because i am really we both are really bad at sleeping <laughs> and um, and so leslie made me a k-pop Sleepy time playlist, <laughs> and sometimes I just lie in bed and I just listen to sleepy BTS songs, and it genuinely works. So thank you BTS, because sometimes I just lie there and I'm like, oh. I mean that's probably not the reaction you want people to have to your songs, but they're really soothing. Before we end this video, I also would like to just say that I feel like you have encouraged me into your world and down the k-hole shown me your k-hole no <laughs> i feel like i'm so sorry i'm literally never lifting my head again it's fine so thank you no you're welcome very much thank bts obviously again thank you yes you all of you for subscribing i'm very grateful because as i said earlier this channel i set up originally because i thought you had to have a channel to watch youtube emma's good at technology if you enjoyed this video please feel free to give it a thumbs up i did enjoy making this video if you enjoyed watching it yay thank you for doing so if you liked what you saw and you want to see more of what i create on this channel click on my floaty head to subscribe and I will try and fit last week's video somewhere for you to click on if you would like to see that. Talk to you next week! Bye!